Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Breaking major arrests. Look who it was. Baghdad, Iraq. Six Islamic State members, including a woman, were arrested in operations in Nineveh province, the Iraqi Interior Ministry announced on Friday. Iraqi News reported. In a press release, the ministry said troops in Nineveh arrested six Islamic State members, including a woman. All are wanted for by courts for trials. Two of them were arrested in Abu Maria village in Talafar, while the rest were in several areas across Mosul, the ministry added. Last week, news reports quoted sources as saying that over 20 as members were arrested in several security operations carried out in west of Mosul. RWT reported that over 90 Islamic State ISIS, terrorists have been killed in Kirkuk as security forces continue launching massive manhunts nationwide in search of dormant ISIS cells, a well-placed security official was quoted as saying Tuesday. As part of ongoing efforts to track down ISIS cells, Iraqi troops managed to kill over 90 as militants and destroyed at least 100 terrorist hotbeds in different security operations in southwestern Kirkuk, commander of the 16th Brigade of Al-Hashd al-Sabi, popular mobilization forces. Nabil Issa al-Bashiri told news media. The anti is security operations have achieved good results so far, he said, citing the killing of five as militants, including three foreigners, in the province Monday, Iraqi News reports. Bashiri stressed that Iraqi troops will continue to hunt for dormant ISIS cells nationwide to protect the country from their threat. The U.S.-led coalition forces are having great success in eliminating ISIS terrorists in the region. For example, Special forces operations on a mission to blow up Islamic State havens in Salahuddin have so far left at least 250 ISIS militants dead since Wednesday, the federal police have announced. Lt. Gen. Shaker Jadat said in a statement that federal police and backing forces have recaptured 190 square miles of the province's as held town of Shirkat, adding that 41 villages were recaptured. 24 booby-trapped vehicles, 15 weaponized trucks and 56 IEDs were also destroyed in the operations, according to Jawadat. 90 families were evacuated during the battle, he said. Islamic State militants emerged in 2014, taking over large areas of Iraq and neighboring Syria to proclaim a self-styled caliphate. Operations by the Iraqi government forces, backed by a U.S.-led coalition and paramilitary forces, have, so far, managed to retake the group's former capital, Mosul, as well as the town of Talafar, both in Nineveh province. Coinciding with the offensives in Shirkat and Hawija, security forces have also launched a campaign to liberate Islamic State's havens in western Anbar's towns of Anna, Rawa, and Ka'im. Despite the group's crushing defeat at its main havens across Iraq, Islamic State continues to launch sporadic attacks against troops with security reports warning that the militant group still poses a threat against stability in the country. We will prevail in the end. War is hell. God bless. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.